but, fight. But, but, but the name. <laughs> like, but he's street Jesus. He's, oh, yeah. He's street and, Jesus. and it's so weird how some people develop a brand that's so likable, like him, where it's like he's a thug. Like he started street fighting in the back with Kimbo Slice. Like he's really tough. No, you. Game bread. Game bread. All right, hold on. You, no, hold no, 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 no. Wait, hold on. Stop, wait, stop, wait, stop, wait, stop, wait. You stop, stop, bitch. Stop, 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 I got to back stop. you up a little bit. Just as far as MMA is concerned, he, he clearly has proven himself. How? 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 Hey, wait, wait. Whoa. I just, yo, don't include me in this. I love Orange. Oh, by a, the way, incredible. great brand. Great brand. Great brand. Well, well he's, he's not stood great the test fighter. versus a lot of good fighters. Hey, 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 that Ooh. would beat Diaz in pretty stock. Diaz isn't good. Diaz isn't good. Look at their records. Everything is, numbers don't fucking lie, bro. I'm undefeated. Like Motherfuckers are undefeated. Diaz literally wins one fight, or he wins two fights and then loses one. It's true. Two fights, loses one. Fuck that. All right, so, so backing up. Even their narrative, though, which was always, I'll go in the boxing ring and destroy this motherfucker, has now changed. Because in that message from the Hiroshima bombing that he took, exactly. he asked you instead of boxing, boxing come to the UFC. You in the <laughs> yeah, yeah, let me come to work Shut for the up. let me come work for the UFC. I make more than every UFC fighter fucking combined, including Connor. Y'all work for fucking Dana. Y'all work for WME Endeavor. That's who you work for. I make more than all of you silly motherfuckers. Why would I go into the UFC and sign a contract to give away my fucking rights and shit? I own my content. I own my platform. I own everything. They don't own shit. They're literally employees. What if it wasn't? I'm a fucking CEO, and, the, and every UFC fighter is an employee. Get that straight. I'm not coming over there and doing shit with you. <laughs> suck <laughs> my nuts, bro. I need it. I'm literally gonna, bro. I'm in, I need a shirt that says "Suck my nuts" because I don't know how else to just express myself. <laughs> You're Literally, doing, you're doing a pretty good job right now. Your shirts have been on point lately. Oh, oh shit! Could if you if it was not financial, could an MMA fight ever happen? Would you ever consider training for the Octagon ever? A after uh, after I'm like 10 and 0, maybe 12 and 0. After I fight, probably Canelo. And I sort of want to go back on my on my uh, point earlier. Like it's not to demean every UFC fighter because obviously you want to be a part of a big platform of course and Jake. I feel like I came off a little strong but like <laughs> <laughs> but like when these guys are talking to me and talking shit online that's when it's just like y'all have no idea what you're talking about you know what about and, and by the way it's fucked up and so the point I'm making is like they're employees I'm, I'm a CEO but the point I'm making also is like the, the situation that they're in is not good and it needs change but don't try to don't try to play the CEO boss shit with me and offers and talk negotiations <laughs> and money because I'll run circles around all these motherfuckers.